Hey guys. Hey guys. Welcome back to our channel. We are still homies. I'm Ellie and this is the Illuminated Larry. And today uh, we will start a serial. Yep. Which one? Uh, we have a lot of suggestions to watch uh, Bands of Brothers. It's okay. about uh, World War II, I think. I'm, I'm not sure. I just okay. saw that so it's like... an army TV show. Uh -huh. okay. And the cool parts, I haven't seen it at all. It's from 2001, from what I saw. I haven't seen it also, and uh, I guess it will be sad, right? I guess so, because they like uh, to see you cry. <laughs> Thank you, guys. I will cry for you. <laughs> yeah. So, are you ready? Yeah. Let's, let's go. Let's go. He says the USA is in a war with Japan. We couldn't believe it. Well, our country was attacked. It's a different. It wasn't like Korea or Vietnam. Who would like to volunteer for the tank corps? Who would like to volunteer for the Air Force? Who would like to volunteer for the Navy or whatever? We came from a small, small town, and three fellows in that town were, that were 4F committed suicide because they couldn't go at different time. Wow. Second okay. world No jump tonight. The evasion has been postponed. We're on a 24 hour stand down. Bitch. Two sergeants take charge. Should have been born earlier, Nex. Or later, like us. Give up all this? Actually, you know, it's from there. Oh, him. Yeah. There's 112 days of that son of a bitch, and here we are. <laughs> you people are at the position of attention! <laughs> Volunteering for the parachute infantry is one thing, Percante, but you've got a long way to prove that you belong here. Your weekend pass is revoked. I wouldn't take this rusty piece of shit to war, and I will not take you to war in your condition. Now, thanks to these men and their infractions, every man in the company who had a weekend pass has lost it. Now, what company is this? Easy Company! Now, what do we do? Kill! Do not help that man! Do not help that man! Do not stop! Well, I come, we're the only company marching every Friday night. 12 miles full pack in the pitch dark. Lieutenant Silver does not hate Easy Company, Private Random. He just hates you. <laughs> Thank you, sir. <laughs> was this man ordered to not drink from his canteen during the Friday night march? He was, sir. Private Christensen, you have disobeyed a direct order. You will fill your canteen and repeat all 12 miles of the march immediately. Yes, sir. Fall out! What in the name of God are you doing with my company? You're late, and you allow troopers to disobey direct orders? I want the names of six men. Their infractions and your disciplinary recommendations on my desk by 0130. Is that clear? What infractions, sir? Find some. <laughs> Ooh. Oh fuck! That's big stuff. Oh fuck! Easy Company has the finest performance record in the entire second battalion. I believe every bit of that. Creepy is... fate. Rosk, what's wrong with you? Congratulations, Captain Sol. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Pornography, contraband. Non-regulation clothing, contraband. This is United States Army property, which was taken without authorization from my mess facility. 
I mean, and come I will on. not tolerate thievery in my unit. All weekend passes are cancelled, officers included. Why are so Fair bad? Enough. I know. As first lieutenant, he'll serve as my executive officer. Congratulations. I am designating you mess officer for 14 days. Report to the mess kitchen at 0515 hours. Company breakfast to be served at 0600. What has changed? Get up! Breakfasts are canceled. Easy Company is running up curry. Move! Oh, okay. I hate someone vomiting. The worst thing ever. And completion of your fifth and final jump. You'll be certified army paratroopers. Stealth missions, light missions, all kinds of stuff. Hopefully, under deployed canopies. Ross is kind of scared. I also think he's scared. Seems scary, more scary. Yeah, because. And I guarantee you, you will be out of the airborne. It got pulls out automatically. No, I mean, they're jumping one, just one and after another. They can split or... Oh, no, they have some distance in front. Now, parachute infantry is a brand new concept in American military history. But by God, the 506 is going to forge that brand new concept into victory. Yeah! I want you to know that I'm damn proud of each and every one of you. So I want you to have fun and remember our motto. Karahe! <laughs> Yeah, it was training. It should be it's uh, 43. The world. No, I think it's a it's training. Start, right? been killed, along with 95% of your company. Leave three wounded men on the ground and report back to the assembly area. So, he gets a little jumpy in the field. Mm -hmm. He gets jumpy and then you get killed. <laughs> That's nice. Yeah, uh, listen, if we discuss it, I think it should just be amongst ourselves. Oh, absolutely. New York City, troop ship, England. <laughs> We're invading Europe, my friend. Oh, is Europa. now is the real deal. That's why they didn't do anything. They were just fighting them with weapons and stuff. Like that. <laughs> but uh, fighting over Sobel. That's smart. Said some that was the reason that um, they attacked it. There are two basic types of fighting positions. The first is a prepared position. The advantages of a prepared position are that it gives you cover and concealment. He's then gonna close with and kill or capture that German. There should be no, there should be no fence here. Um, <clears throat> we, we could go over it, sir. Really? That's not the point. We're the goddamn... Where the goddamn hell are we? Fogel's lost again, right? Yeah, he's lost. <laughs> he left. Oh, Isn't that the intersection? No, sir, it's here. You're full grid off. Mr. Sober. <laughs> Offense! Say, um. Oh my God. Now oh, you cut that fence and get this goddamn <laughs> dude on the move! <laughs> yes, sir! <laughs> Tell Garner to move left with second. I'll be right up the middle with third. Go. Yes, sir.
She's like, I'm out of here. <laughs> yeah, because they split from the group. <laughs> I said You've captured me. Oh, he was the target. Would that be the enemy? As a matter of fact, yes. Yeah. So what the fuck who was the idiot who cut that man's fence? <laughs> I was ordered to, sir. <laughs> Major Horton, sir. Major Horton is on leave in London. This <laughs> <laughs> cow's out of here. <laughs> I changed the time to 0945. No one told me, sir. I telephoned. I'm courted with a family that has no telephone. And sent a runner. No runner found me, Captain. You failed to do so. Were to let such a failure of duty by my own XO go unpunished, what kind of message is that to the men? Punishment for your offenses will be denial of a 48-hour pass for 60 days. Stand before me at attention. Or you may initiate a letter of appeal and request a trial by court-martial. My endorsement, sir. I request trial by court-martial. <laughs> Of course. So we're going through with this, right? We've got to do something. Yeah. Yeah. But we'd all better be clear of the consequences. I don't care about the consequences. John, we could be lined up against a wall and shot. All right, boys. Good luck. All of you NCOs have disgraced the 101st Airborne. You can consider yourself lucky that we are on the eve of the largest action in the history of warfare, which leaves me no choice but to spare your lives. I can only speculate, sir. Most of the men would, would never do this, but I believe just a few of the sergeants may have felt their loyalty lay more to the platoon than to the company. The division has established a parachute training school at Chilton Foley. The idea is for non-infantry types who who are vital to the coming invasion, such as doctors and chaplains. He's the jump training there. I'm losing easy company? War if it needs you elsewhere. So I guess in real life it's a bit different. <laughs> so fits my <laughs> inner <Life> style. Inner <laughs> style, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Everyone's objective, gentlemen, is to take the town of Carentan, or Carentan, thus linking Utah and Omaha into a single continuous beachhead. Omaha and Utah into one continuous beachhead. In the meantime, study these sand tables, maps, and reconnaissance photos until you can draw a map of the area by memory. Now, between our assembly area and the battalion's objective, there is a German garrison right here in this area, San Marie de Mont. Easy Company will destroy that garrison. If you did not sign your GI life insurance policy, you go on over and see Sergeant Evans at the headquarters company tent. You boys don't let your families miss out on ten thousand dollars. Hear that, wow. Jerry? Going his brother in Italy, Henry, killed in Monte Cassino. Well, I'm sure he doesn't know. Damn. Today, as you read this, you are en route to the great adventure for which you have trained for over two years. That's why they gave us ice cream. No jump tonight. The invasion has been postponed. We're on a 24-hour stand down. Uh, Bill Garnier's brother. And now he's gonna tell him. My back is hurting me just by watching how much stuff they're wearing. Get jacked yeah. by mistake. Sorry about your brother, Bill. Yes, my so, yeah, it was my mom. He was, uh... Let's get this 
over with. Dude, that's super heavy. Alright, so <laughs> I guess the first one was just to get you started. Yeah, but I like it very much, so I can't wait. Let's watch one more. You want to watch one more now? Yeah. Sure. Sure. <laughs> okay. Yeah, because it finished just before you see the fights. So I guess the next one is when they start to do the action. Mm. You want to see the fight? Yeah, of course. Well, yeah. we, we just finished there, so at least we see they are preparing for two years and to not see what actually they are going well, to do. It's, uh, well, it's a nice movie. I like it. TV show. Yeah. So, oh. yeah, I see you in the next one. <laughs> yeah, see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.